than 12 years of conception, of planning, and actual production, Covadis has been completed, and a dream has been fulfilled. Covadis was filmed in Rome, amid the actual sites of its historic locale, through the vivid reality of color by technicolor, Imperial Rome is recreated, glorious and corrupt, awesome and hallowed. Here you will meet Marcus Vinicius, Robert Taylor. Through a performance of masterful artistry, he will have lost his own identity and become Marcus Vinicius, brave warrior, generous and yet capable of cruelty and unbridled self-will. And here, with Marcus Vinicius, you meet Lydia, the Christian slave girl, who in time will dominate his life. Deborah Carr is Lydia, a pagan to his fingertips as the suave and ironical Petronius. The eminent actor Leo Gen recreates Nero's arbiter of elegance. And here is history's evil genius, Nero. Sigilinus! Where's my god? Sigilinus! Under the forehead of a demigod and the face of a beast, he was a drunkard and a sensualist, full of changing desires and swollen with fat and crime. So has history described him, and so he is recreated by Peter Ustinov, in a magnificent performance. The Empress Poppea, a hard and calculating wife whose hand shaped the fate of Nero's world. The giant Christian slave Ursus, a man of tremendous strength and the gentleness of a child. Here the fisherman, Simon called Peter. In all, there are 110 speaking parts in Quo Vadis. An unprecedented cast of 30,000 men, women, and children. You will see thousands upon thousands of players appearing in a single scene. No achievement in entertainment history has equaled the panoramic spectacle, the splendor, the power, and the compelling human drama of Quo Vadis. It is an experience which cannot be compared with anything you have ever known before. You'll witness the infamous revelry of a night in Nero's court. You'll stand with the Christians in the catacombs. See the battle of the giants. You'll know the love of Marcus and Lydia, the spectacle of Nero's circus, the terror of the arena when Ursus stands alone against death. happening that will be remembered as long as history, the burning of Rome. <laughs> Standing here in the shadows of antiquity's pagan gods, you will join with Rome's roaring multitudes as they honor their victorious warriors. And you'll know why Quo Vadis has been called the most genuinely colossal movie you are likely to see for the rest of your lives.